Welcome to Tally Help videos. In this video, you will understand the process of specifying opening and closing stock value manually using stock in hand ledger in Tally Prime. The opening and closing stock values reflect in your stock summary report and become part of profit and loss account and the current assets of your balance sheet. However, there can be situations in which there is a mismatch in the opening and closing stock value compared to the values assessed by your auditor. This may happen in case of manual data entry errors. In a different scenario, you might have migrated your company data from a different software or started books in the middle of the year, say January. In such cases, you may want to specify the opening and closing stock value in Tally Prime. Let's see how to do. Press F11. Set Integrate Accounts with Inventory as No and press Ctrl plus A to save. If you are not maintaining inventory in your company data, then you do not have to follow this step. You can directly follow the next steps. Now, let's create a stock in hand ledger. Press Alt plus G. Create master ledger and press enter. Enter the name of the ledger. Under group, select stock in hand and press enter. Enter the correct opening balance. Press Ctrl plus A to save the ledger. Now, let's alter the ledger to enter the closing balance. Press Alt plus G. Alter master. Ledger. Type or select the name of the ledger and press enter. Enter the date and the correct closing balance. You can keep updating the closing balance every month by providing the date if needed. Press Ctrl plus A to save the ledger. Now, let's open the profit and loss account. Press Alt plus G. Type or select profit and loss account and press enter. Please note that you need to press F2 and change the period in profit and loss account. To view the opening and closing stock value based on the date and values entered in the stock in hand ledger. And you can also view the ledger from which the values are considered. Thank you. To know more about Tally Prime features, visit help.tallysolutions.com. Subscribe to the Tally Solutions channel for the latest videos.